Joe, Tim, and Dre on the heels of Tiafimo Lopez's unanimous decision win over Masayoshi Nakatani. Not the kind of fight most expected. Most everybody thought Lopez would get rid of Nakatani, but Nakatani, 18-0. Game tall. That impacted the fight probably more than people realized. And Lopez assessed that afterwards as well, <laughs> saying, I was horrible. The guy's got height. Sometime I'm a little lazy. You said he was exposed. You said lesson learned. He takes a step forward. Is he ready for now what he has earned? And that is a title shot against the champion in the IBF at 135 pounds, Richard Comey. Well, Tess, this, it's going to happen. The fight's going to happen. Now he's in line to face it. But Is he ready for it based on what you saw? With this type of performance? Absolutely not. Richard Comey has power in both hands. You have to understand that. He has a right hand. And the right hand landed quite a bit for Nakatani tonight. Quite a bit. You know, there's a there's a pattern that I see with Lopez. You know, if he can't get you with the looping right hand or the looping left hook, he wants to step inside and hit you down to the body like this. And then it's this this is this is what he depends on. The shoulder roll. He misjudges the distance all the time. He gets hit cleanly with right hands. And obviously he needs to go back to the drawing board and fix a lot of things before the championship fight. Look, you're right, Tim. The fight is gonna happen, whether they want it to happen or not. It's, he's put himself in a position to fight for a belt. They've talked themselves into a position to fight for this belt, so the, the, the fight has to happen. He's ready, but with a caveat. Joe, he needs to go back to the gym, and he and his father need to give an honest assessment of his performance. Couple key areas. He has to get his left hand up. He does the Floyd Mayweather shoulder roll, but here's the difference. The Mayweather family has been doing that move since the beginning, since Floyd Mayweather's been a baby, it's a natural thing. That's something that Teofimo has duplicated. It's not something he learned from the crib. He also has to start using his left hand and using his jab. And anybody that tunes in to our broadcast, they hear me say that like it's a broken record, but I can't say it enough. You're not going to knock everybody out. We saw that tonight. Sometimes, and you can't explain it, guys are just not going to go anywhere. Nakatani didn't go anywhere tonight. We didn't see the Teofimo that we're used to seeing but I like it. Long term, uh -huh. I like it. He Going needs to distance, go the round. He's got to go the round. Getting the experience. And Joe, Remember, he's only 21. One more thing. It humbled him a little bit. Hopefully. Yes. That's great. Yes. You got to go home, lick your wounds a little bit, and realize, you know what? Maybe I'm not such a big puncher. I know I can hit hard, but but maybe I need to work on some other things. But, Hopefully that's what but happens. But Dre, also, to piggyback off that, there's three things that now he has to worry about. The fact that he has his family issues going on, the fact that he has the weight now, and then the fact that he has to go back to the drawing board and correct some things. A lot of big it, decisions. It's probably great that this happened to him at this point in his career because the championship is next. Yeah, and everybody's just got to pause, too, so early in his career. Yeah, it's just, just been this rocket ride because of all the spectacular knockouts. But 21 years old, now 14-0, and and earning a title shot is Tiafimo Lopez. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For more sports highlights and analysis, be sure to download the ESPN app. And for live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.